Assalamu alaikum friends. My name is Muhammad Yunus and I am Odoo Technical Developer. In the previous video, we have added three menu items, Open Academy, Open Academy and then Courses. And also we have added um, action for this uh, model. So in this video, we are going to talk about basic views like Form View and Tree View and we will add a uh, form view for this uh, model and also we will add the tree view what is a view view define the way the records of a model are displayed so each type of view represent mode of visualization we can view the data in different kind of views like this is the tree view and this is the form view can be view and uh, calendar view to see a list of records graph of the their aggregation views can either be requested generically by, by their type in the action uh, for example let me show you this is the action we have added in the action we define the views mode either it can be called generically uh, just by adding the view type or our a list of parameters are specifically uh, via their id either we can call uh, the external id of that view and uh, that view will be displayed uh, when we click on this menu item so for generic request the view with the correct type and the lowest priority will be used in the views uh, we define uh, a field uh, with the name priority and the the view with the lowest priority will uh, appear on the uh, screen so the lowest priority view of which type is default is default view for that type so view inheritance we have already covered in the uh, previous video so you can watch it uh, again generic view declaration a view is declared as a record of models so ui view is uh, the model of uh, ORM and uh, so it is uh, the view every kind of view is defined as um, a record of this model ir.ui.view uh, the view type is implied uh, by the root element of the arc field so in this arc field inside this arc field uh, we can dis define the views types so uh, the format of the uh, view is the definition of the view is uh, uh, like first we have to add uh, the record tag and then the model a model will be remain will remain the same in all the cases ir.ui.view and then the xml id it uh should be unique per uh module and then the name of the uh then the name of the view it should be in this format like uh if we if we will uh, just define it uh in a bit and then we need to add the object uh the model of the view then we need to add the priority which is not the mandatory uh, field and then we need to add the arc field the type of the arc field should be xml so that it can be interpreted correctly inside this we can define a view like form view tree view and graph view what uh, is the type of the view so tree views how we can define tree views tree views also called list views so in uh, Odoo, this is the tree view let me show you this is the tree view so this we can also call it a, a list view display records in a tabular form so this displays the record in a table form let me i will show you once we develop it so the root element of the tree view is a tree and inside it we define we can add the string the label of the views and then inside that we add the fields the fields which we want to display each column is a each field is will uh, represent a column so let me just add it uh, inside our view uh, let me just copy it and then open the py charm so th what is the uh, best way to add uh, and where is we can add it we should add it uh, before the uh, action 
because sometimes uh, we uh, want to just uh, add specifically add the view inside the uh, action so it should the view uh, should be loaded before uh, otherwise the database will not uh, recognize that external id so let me just uh, add the id uh, view uh, courses tree you can add any uh, id here this is the uh, name of the uh, view view courses uh, c o u courses dot tree and uh, again here you need to add the object name the object name is open academy dot course and this one so after that you need to add the priority period should be uh, if you want to um, if you want to uh, make it by default so add uh, one as a priority here we can add the view we want to add the uh, tree view first uh, and then i will add the string which is uh, courses and then i will add field name equal to uh, what is the name of the field which is uh, first one is name and the other one is description inside this one and then field name is equal to description and close the tag so this is the tree that we have added let me just uh, upgrade this module let me upgrade it from here and let's see the change that we have made by default uh, the view was just displaying the name of the uh, course but now we will able to see the uh, description also so this is the tree view that we have added let me just check from the debug view edit view list so we can see views view courses that tree tree is the type and our model name this is the sequence so this is the external id we have added and this is the view definition and the second thing we uh, we are gonna add in this video is uh, the form view uh, so what we need to do form views are used to create and edit the records uh, for example if i click uh, the create button i can see the form view so i just need to add some styling and placing the uh, fields and some uh, and want to minimize the width of the field so uh, the root element is form in the tree view it was tree and in this case it will be form they are composed of high level structure elements like groups notebooks and interactive elements like buttons and fields so we can add fields buttons notebooks and groups so this is just the basic uh, structure of the form view form view uh, form same like tree and string is equal to the label of the uh, form view uh, and let me just uh, add the form view like this one and copy this one and then paste it here i will edit uh, after tree view you can edit anywhere uh, so let me just uh, add some identification to make it correct uh, so this is the external id of the form view and this is the course.form.view uh, is the name of the view this is the model uh, so this definition is the same as the mm, is same as for all the views here uh, we need to add form uh, instead of tree view and then this is the string so i can just make it as a course this uh, you need to add the sheet uh, uh, and inside the sheet uh, you can add the group to make it uh, looks uh, good so let me just uh, upgrade the module and then let's see how this uh, changes the view let me just uh, duplicate it for you so that we can uh, differentiate between the so after that uh, we will be able to see the difference uh, between the two views now let me just open it open academy and then click here so we can see this is the uh, difference that we can see like just me open it here 
there is a lot of space between it and this is just uh, minimized if you want to uh, add it here and the other field here we just need to add another group uh, like this one let me just add it group so i will add it uh, here and then another one here to make it looks correctly so let me just upgrade the module so let me upgrade it and let's see the change that we have made so open academy and click this one so we can see the change here so this is the form view that we have added um, so some of the more uh, topics that we need to cover notebooks how we can add the notebooks in the course view put the description field under the tab this way we can add the uh, so we just need to add the notebook uh, tag and then we need to add the page tag so this way we can uh, add the notebook also so let me just add it for example copy it notebook here and then close it inside it uh, add the page and then string is uh, just testing in the view for example, let me edit field name is equal to description. If I uh, just upgrade the module, click the upgrade button, and uh, let's see. So we got an error message opening and close ending take mismatch so let me just check it so we can see it here what is the issue so we forgot uh, uh, close this so let me just upgrade it again and then we will see the change now hopefully so let me just uh, open the view form view and we can see and we can also edit this one so if we create the uh, create button so if we click this one uh order 13 technical course so here i just add the description please subscribe Thank you.